I did a little bit of research, like a tad bit on Singapore last night, a little bit right before we started. And they're, they're really into caning, like caning people. And um, I'm imagining that's not you grab a cane and walk around the park and twirl it around. <laughs> uh, that's, is it like, that's just a punishment, like where they tie you up and cane you? Yeah, and it's, <laughs> it's all on the ass. This was surprising <laughs> that I learned. It's like, you, you should Google this. Maybe you can insert like a YouTube video here. Uh, they don't have any videos on uh, it being done in Singapore, because, probably because Singapore monitors that stuff, frankly. Um, but you can find it being done in like Malaysia. But basically, they, uh, you know, if you get caught for something, you know, doing something illegal, it's usually more like big time, uh, you know, highly illegal stuff. Um, not just like jaywalking or something like that. But um, basically, they like strap you into this, this, ordeal like imagine you know like not like a uh, like a big x you know your legs are kind of fastened this way and your arms are kind of fastened this way and then you're kind of like bent over and your bare ass is right is exposed and there's like there's it's a cane and a cane is like basically a bamboo stick but at the end it's frayed so like think of like the end of like very strong bristles not like a broom brush but like very strong sharp bristles and they like wham they'll do it over your ass i think the most they can give you is 24 because after about four or five hits it starts to break the skin so like they hit you really hard but they're not but they're humane about it right there's a specific amount of force that they're supposed to drive behind that there's like a person it's like uh, the equivalent of like the hangman there's somebody who that's his job is like the, the caner um you know he knows how hard to hit you like how to hit you uh, and all that so, and they have somebody monitoring, who's like talking to you the whole time, like, okay, Craig, that's hit number five. You've only got six <laughs> to go, like coaching you through it the whole time. So like, there's, there's somebody not holding your hand, but kind of like guiding you through it while you're being uh, whipped on the ass in, you know, in jail. Sounds like the, a, a the weird part, sorry, real quick, the, the weird part is like, say you're in jail for, so you get a five year sentence, prison, whatever and caning is part of your sentencing, they don't like, they don't tell you what it is. So there's like a mental punishment to it too. So it could be on day one and it could be on day, you know, the last day of your punishment. So you have to sit there and worry in fear. When is this, when is this caning coming to? That's so worse. That's worse. <laughs> yeah. That, that is. is. But you know what? People pay for that kind of treatment here in the States. Shit. I yeah, you have to pay for that. I want you to get the trouble on purpose over there. <laughs> <laughs> no, you should you should look it up. It does not look pleasant uh, at all. Hey, that's the universe, baby. That's awesome, man. Uh, yeah. I got, crazy thing is, I got a phone call too. It was from an old friend. He's like, hey, I heard an old podcast we did together. It's not for you. Don't do it. Just stop. <laughs> I'm fucking around. <laughs> <laughs> I was just about to say, you better tell him, fuck you. But I, I also have some things to share. But, dude, we'll just jump right into it. We'll start off with, like, you know, what the show's about. And then, and then I'll just pass it directly on to you. And you can talk about how it's affected you. And then, and then you talk for a little bit. You know, we'll just bounce off each other. And then I'll go. And then we'll go into like what's going on in the world and, and all this other bullshit. Oh, cutting out. Ah, oh, fuck. It's weird, like when you do DMT. <laughs> Don't you ever just watch Fox though? Like, I mean, I, I don't ever watch Fox, but I, I, I look at like stuff on Twitter and stuff and, and like Instagram, like short videos. Like, I always think like, dude, 
there's got to be so many affairs. Like, dude, the, the women and men on there just seem so dirty. Like, they probably fucking each other all the time. And I was like, oh, shit, this shit real. Like, I wasn't prepared. I thought I was going to be like, dude, dude, dude. But it's like, what? And I was just like, <laughs> and then, like, I was like, fuck, I got to go next. I can't be a bitch. In the end, I was like, thank you for agreeing to have this threesome with me. You know? <laughs> like, oh, fuck me in my head. You know, like, but I dragged it out forever. They had to keep playing with the teacher. I was like, keep going, keep going. What's his name? I don't remember. 